All right, y'all. <clears throat> We're going to do a little shedding today. Um, I want to get more chromatic. So, uh, I'm working on some 2 5 stuff. You can just get in your D minor, G7 to C like that. You can use chordal voicings, maybe something like this. Use your standard these guys get a little altered in there if you want all right so we've done these Uh, but we're going to approach it from here. Uh, uh, so it's a loose, it's a loose interpretation. Uh, to this. Uh, uh, and uh, the way I'm getting to this note is through a very windy chromatic passage. So, uh, three options. extend my approach to here. That's one. Four from above. Two from above. Two from below. Two from above. But um, I really want to get something a little less obvious. So it's like starting with an approach to this. Yeah. So if 
if I go up here, let's say two five one to E flat. doing these kinds of practices that you transpose it to another key and you find that stuff that you play in that other key and you realize oh shoot I don't play that in this key but I want to ah. So, so nicely in the fingers in F.
that. Let's see and see. Yeah. take some of that to 12 keys and maybe put on a drum track tighten it up maybe choose one thing that you really like play it through 12 keys get a voicing in place that you really like that works with that line Thank you. 
Yeah. All right. I'm going to keep working on it. Happy practicing, y'all.